Hi guys. Um, so I have a friend of mine. I look out for her health and she looks out for mine. One of my besties. I love her dearly. Um, but she thought I should make this stuff up. And um, so I'm going to be putting the link, by the way, before I start in the description box. And you can go and read the information yourself. It's from Dr. Mercola. If you're familiar with him, um, you know he's pretty good. Um, okay, the stuff is called, I don't know if it's Salt Soul or Salt Soleil. I don't know. We're going to call it Soleil because it sounds cool. Okay, so what you're going to do is you are going to get a salt, good quality. As you see, I have Himalayan. And um, you can use, as long as it's real salt, Celtic, any of that you can use it okay so what you're gonna do is you're gonna get a glass jar Himalayan salt and you want something with a plastic lid to go on this now I don't have a plastic lid so I just cut me a piece of plastic that's gonna go inside my lid and hopefully that is going to work so we're going to fill the jar up with a quarter of the way with um, our salt and then you're going to fill the rest of the jar up with filtered water and that's what I have here and hopefully I have enough yes I do how about that then you're gonna put the lid on it and shake it up okay Himalayan pink salt as we all know has um, lots of minerals and electrolytes and everything that's really good for our body in it this is, uh, by the way, supposed to last indefinitely on your counter because it's antibacterial and antifungal. So I shook it. Voila. Um, what you're supposed to do is leave this overnight. Just stick it back on your counter and um, let the salt fully dissolve in there. And in the morning, if you come back and there is salt on the bottom, then you've done good because the water has absorbed all the salt that it can and it is ready for immediate use if the next morning there is no salt in the bottom then you want to add more salt shake it two or three times yes I shook it too much and again leave it overnight until there is some salt that remains on the bottom of the jar it does not need to be stirred and you are to take this on an empty stomach you're going to take two to three teaspoons and put that into a glass of water and drink it to get you your minerals and electrolytes and all the other good things that this salt um, does for our bodies it lasts indefinitely because it is antibacterial and antifungal and again, like I said, there's going to be a link below. That's it. So this is take two. Hopefully this sound works. So y'all have a wonderful day and God bless you all.